Hello, welcome to the Maths Academy. We have to solve very interesting question that is x plus 8 whole square is equal to 64 and we have to find the value of x. To solve this question, we can solve this question by two methods. Method number one is In method 1, to solve this, we have to use this identity a square minus b square is equal to a minus b into a plus b. So by using this identity, we can solve this question. Let me solve this by method 1. The question is x plus 8 whole square is equal to 64 now x plus 8 whole square we move the 64 to the left side minus 64 is equal to 0 x plus 8 whole square minus 64 can be written as 8 square is equal to 0. Now suppose this is equal to A and this is B and now we have to apply this identity A minus B into A plus B. So this will become X plus 8 that is A minus B that is 8 into x plus 8 that is a and plus b mean plus 8 is equal to 0. Now plus 8 cancel with the minus 8 and this will become x into x and 8 plus 8 is equal to 16 is equal to 0. Now here we have to apply uh, the zero product rule here that is if a time b is equal to 0 then either a is equal to 0 or b is equal to 0. So by applying this zero product rule here this will become x is equal to 0 or x plus 16 is equal to 0. So x is equal to 0 this is the first solution or x is equal to we have to move the 16 to the right side this will become minus 16 and this is an other value of x. So this is the method 1. Now we have to solve this question by the second method, method 2. To solve this question by method 2 we have to use the formula a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus 2 a times b plus b square. So we have to write the question. The question is x plus 8 whole square is equal to 64. Now we have to apply this identity here. This will become x square plus 2 times x time 8 plus 8 square is equal to 64 and this will become x square plus 16 x plus 64 is equal to 0 so x square plus 16 x plus 64 and this 64 is here 
now we have to move this 64 to the left side by minus 64 so this will become x square plus 16x plus 64 and we have to move this 64 to the left side minus 64 is equal to 0 now this 64 plus 64 cancel with the minus 64 and here we obtain x square plus 16x is equal to 0 now we have to come on x so this will become x into x plus 16 is equal to 0 now here we have to apply the zero product rule that will be equal to x is equal to 0 or x plus 16 is equal to 0 so the when one value is x is equal to 0 and the other is x is equal to we have to move the 16 to the right side this will become minus 16 so through second method we obtain the same value as the method 1 x is equal to 0 and x is equal to minus 16 now we have to check our answer the question is x plus 8 whole square is equal to 64 now first of all we have to put x is equal to 0 so by putting 0 in place of x 0 plus 8 whole square is equal to 64 0 plus 8 is equal to 8 square is equal to 64 and this will become at add the 64 64 is equal to 64 so this is verified now we have to put x is equal to minus 16 so the question is uh, x plus 8 whole square is equal to 64 by putting minus 16 this will become minus 16 plus 8 is equal to 64 and minus 16 plus 8 will become minus 8 square is equal to 64 and minus 8 time minus 8 will become 64 is equal to 64 so this is also proved so our answer is x is equal to 0 and x is equal to minus 16 are correct thank you for watching